for the Lord of the Rings trilogy. And Fiona Cumming reports it's a film set locals want to keep. The mystical city Adoris, the capital of Rohan, rising above the shrouded South Canterbury Hills. Tolkien's world of Middle Earth was about 7,000 years ago, so we needed to find a location that was as remote as possible with nothing surrounding it, with some beautiful vistas and views. Construction began six months ago under a cloak of secrecy. Now it's become a sightseeing must for locals. I think it's incredible. I think it's just brilliant, actually. And I just couldn't resist getting hold of uh, the boss lady and, and seeing if I could come up here and have a look. And in the nearby town of Methven, many want the ancient city to stay. Imagine anthropologists in 50,000 years thinking that a whole bunch of three-foot three people lived in the hills be, <laughs> behind the, up the Ashburton Gorge. 200 rooms in the district have been booked for cast and crew, the town gearing up to host some famous faces. Yeah, it'd be really interesting. Um, yeah, Liv Tyler, I don't know. Who else is in it? Pete Jackson. That'd be quite nice to see him wandering around in his shorts and jungles. <laughs> Base camp as close as we are allowed to get. These huge marquees will soon hold hundreds of extras waiting their call. And we're shooting some very large crowd scenes with Rohan people, and so it's quite a big logistic thing to plan. A logistical exercise too for location managers who've had to deal with the extremes of South Island weather. It's fun. It's not a problem. You know, we had the road wash out on the weekend from just abnormal rainfalls and um, the, you know, the mountain re-diverted its river and decided to almost flow directly into our camp here. The city will be dismantled when filming's finished in a few weeks, but it will return on the silver screen when the second film in the trilogy, The Two Towers, is released in 2002. Fiona Cumming, One News.